show you something you've never seen And both you and I should be too shy by late Hi there, good morning. It's Wednesday today and I'm headed out to work. I'm actually going to shoot today for Femme Noctobesi. I told you guys I constantly work with them every time so at every point there's actually something to shoot. I'm going to shoot during lunch. My colleague is going to help me do that. My main dilemma now guys is that I have a wedding on Sunday. I just got like the official invite yesterday and there's a dress code. Dress code is not that difficult. It's white or black. Obviously it's white. White is a wedding. You don't want to be looking too too bridal because I'm not on the train or anything so I want to look edgy a bit in fact I have a lot of options but I'll tailor it to two there's a third one but it's eBay and I don't really trust eBay one of them is like a dress I'll put it on the screen now and the other one is um, like a, a blazer kind of thing double breasted blazer and then pants but I don't want to wear the same color of pants I just think it's boring do you get so I'm thinking of like a white blazer and black pants if I ask my husband to choose he's definitely going to choose that dress because he doesn't like drama also on Saturday guys I'm actually hanging out with the girls Ada, Yawadi Google and Anita, some friends. I'll probably take my camera along as well. And I'm going to London today because I miss my husband. And let me head out to work now. Yeah. Stop trying to use two buses to get to Malibu instead of using the underground just so that I don't incur necessary costs this morning. Anyway, um, as I told you guys, I showed him the outfit. But he, obviously, I told you, shows the dress. I'm heading out to work now and see you guys later. Friday and I'm done with work for the week. Heading out to London. See you London guys. Welcome guys and guess what happened so yesterday when it saw deliveries now I was in second deliveries I told you I ordered a dress first and then because I knew it was my husband was going to choose it so I ordered it and then when I spoke to my friend and told her what I really wanted so she's like yeah I should go ahead and like it might be nice and everything so I was like okay let me just order the second one so I ordered both of them the next day came because only the first, second one came so you can imagine I was just like well maybe God wants me to wear that second outfit and I just you know left everything all right and today the first one now came what I'm going to do is to open it turn it up upside down put it back in the bag put their collectors and return it because I'm not really not about that confusion life in how many hours I'm getting dressed now we're gonna have dinner and then something else uh, it's this crop shirt um excuse the room and then so you got a pants I've had this crop shirt for a long time it was a thrifted piece and I've just loved it I loved it I loved it over and over again anyway I'll probably put in a picture if I take something on Instagram which I definitely would so yeah let's go so am I the only one who does handing up on the bus like I just literally all the girls are running late 15 minutes 20 minutes so we're at the restaurant now and everybody is late outside in fact I was late too let me not lie but she was the only one that was early say hi hello how about Ellie? Yeah. Goa. Ellie Goa. You see, you actually Ellie. I'm very early. And she gave me a time. Give me like nine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, you guys are waiting for the rest of them. They started drinking on their heads. Shame all of them. They started drinking. Shame them. <laughs> they don't pay for the drinks. Look at this babe. She's so late. I'll film it. Let's come out. Let's come out. I'm telling you. That's your excuse, Abby. She said it's not her own. She has been ready since. She's ready for you to leave since. <laughs> this is here, one day, guys. A hot mess. He was a drawer, right? It's always one. It's always a drawer. It's going to be telling me that there's a daily life. Really like. Let's look at what these girls came to do outside. They left their food on the table. To come, to come and start information. The night bridge. Okay. I need one for my. Insta. Okay. They have bank holiday. Ten, like ten bank holiday. Night is over, and um, husband just got an Uber to pick me up. Okay, I had a good time. Girls, everything was really nice. See you guys bright and early. Cheers.
To make your way down to the lawn this way, straight away. Ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon to you again. I'm asked to advise you that the groom Michael is ready and will be coming in a moment. Thank you. Gentlemen, may I ask you please all to stand to receive the bride. We just done with the white wedding. We waited for like an hour. I was wondering why we waited for an hour. I just realized that the couple, the an helicopter, and they want to land with them, everybody to watch. So everyone has been asked to come down now. So we're going to see them land. Stab is magic. We are here, man. We are here. We arrived. Yeah. There we go. What's popping? What's popping? What's popping? What's popping? What's popping? About to head back. Don't worry, don't worry. You know? We just need to get the dogs back in the house. Yeah, boys. Hey, boys. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you. 
sun with me So I can show you something you've never seen And both you and I should be too shy by letting go for Make up your mind